Hello Libra, welcome to my channel. This will be a reading for the week of the 14th of February. Please bear in mind that these are general readings, so it may not resonate for everybody. So please take what doesn't, leave what doesn't. If you like the reading, please like, share and subscribe. I would very much appreciate that. Also, I'd like to thank all of you so much for your support and donations. I am truly so very, very grateful for all of that. Um... Okay, so we have the coffee cup that I'll be reading and also putting out some cards here. We have the lovely Crow Tarot. Absolutely love these cards. Um, okay, Libra, let's begin. Libra, Libra. Libra, I see you here. You're starting to really see steer the wheel you are in control of the wheel now and you're steering it to the direction that you have been meaning to go for quite some time i see you are now actually making changes um in real time what i mean by that is uh you've been it seems like, you know, you were eager to make certain changes around you. That could be your workplace or home life. There's something there. And that's finally coming to fruition. But it's because you are finally kind of, um, you're stepping out of your comfort zone, Libra. Um, and you are starting to show uh, how you feel, what you want to say to the people that um, need to hear it in order to help uh, bring in that change. So it could be a boss that you need to say something to and change something, or you know, it could be a friend. I do see loyalty here, Libra. I see loyalty is a big thing in, in this period. Um, you may start to see... Uh, who your true friends are there could be certain situations that come about and some people that you may have been close with for some time reveal their true colors for some of you um, I definitely see you again gaining more control of certain situations I see um, more respect <laughs> towards you as well and this could be because you are, like I said, stepping out of your comfort zone. You're doing something a little bit different here. Um, and it's, it, it's you wanting and needing to breathe. Um, there could have been a lot of sort of calamity, a bit of chaos recently. And now, you know, as a Libra, you need balance. Um, and I do see things harmonizing. You're needing that harmony. You've been feeling off balance. And that is why you're starting to really uh, take those actions to make certain changes here. I see that you're kind of tired of, of this chaos as well. You are get, getting quite a, a, a few different uh, types of news coming in coming from all different directions. Um, there, there is some news that's going to come in that's going to require you to take big actions. Okay? If that resonates with some of you, and, and, and I hope you understand what I'm saying. Something is going to come in and it's going to really require you to do some work, but it's something positive for you. Um, you're needing to take certain actions. And also I see you preparing yourself for something major, a milestone for some of you also, a certain milestone. Um, Relationship-wise, I do see something moving. There is movement. There's things that are happening that are in motion. I do see here also something to do with an age gap so for some of you there could be a large age gap um and that's all good it's all okay there's some uh, i see peace coming in terms of that so perhaps you or the other person was worried about that 
that worry is no longer. This could be just even for one of you out there, but that, that is what I see. So age gap is not an issue. There is a lot of talk of love here. Love is love. No one's here to judge. Um, and I see a, a, a child being involved as well in a certain uh, dynamic of a relationship um, and sweet gestures that come with it. I think you'll be pleasantly surprised here. Um, someone around you sees you as the apple of their eye. Now, this could be a parent, sibling, friend, and someone very dear and special to you sees you as the apple of their uh, your eye, and they always will. You know, they could very well be in the spirit world not physically present but spiritually present and I do see you being guided and very very protected when it comes to that also um, there's a lot of love being shown for you as well there's something Libra that you need to dig a little bit deeper in uh, some, someone is going to be reaching out to you and this, it's asking that you dig a little deeper um, behind the reason for this or, or they may ask you to do something. It's just something you need to definitely look into a bit more. If you're given a contract, read the small print, read through everything uh, before you sign. It should be okay, but you need to make sure that you have control over that and are aware of everything that's going on as well. Um, someone has been keeping an eye out on you. Someone has been watching you for a long time, Libra. They've been watching you very cl carefully, closely, and they've been waiting on something. Um, it's not bad, no. Someone is very amused <laughs> by you. <laughs> and there's a lot of admiration. So I see here uh, someone regal, you know, like either a king or a queen. Um, there is definitely a high, like strong status, high power in your status that's happening as well. You know, there's the, the way you move, something is coming forward, and it could also mean that um, when it comes to relationships, you're going to be treated like that king or queen, you know? Um, also, some, some a few um, mystical things I see happening as well, where you're going to kind of feel like, oh, this is, is too much of a coincidence. C certain things you may experience that you're going to really um it will throw you off but in in a in a nice you know strange way like uh really you know something very mystical anyway you know maybe that a certain spiritual experience you may have or feeling um it's going to make you feel very, very good because uh, it gives you certain answers. Okay, Libra. Mm -hmm. Let's see, let's see. Changes in work, by the way. Changes in your job and work. Yeah. Uh, but according to what you want. Social life is improving. I, uh, sorry, I just had to say that your social life is improving here. All right, Libra, let's see what the cards have. The Hermit. <laughs> okay. Queen of Pentacles. Okay. Yep. And, and we have here the Nine of Wands. So... Uh, you, you're starting to trust yourself a lot more and you know that uh, whenever you, let's say, don't listen to your intuition, things don't always necessarily go your way, but when you do, 
things start to reveal itself. You start to understand um, and trust your instincts. That's what's coming about. Finances is becoming more stable. Um, and you're also trusting where you invest your money, if that, that is for some of you also. But there is, there is something coming in where you could be um, having, a, again, more... You're more in control of your finances, you know. There's different streams of income happening as well that you've created. And with the nine of ones, uh, just definitely do not give up just yet. You're too much of a warrior, Libra. You're too much of a warrior. And you know and trust within you that uh, you're going in the right direction. There's a lot. You see that sun behind the cloud here? It's coming up. It's coming out. It's your perseverance keep going queen of swords look at that queen of swords <laughs> the empress this is you the queen of swords the empress i was saying this very strong regal feeling here king queen you know um truth is coming about but this is you the queen of swords and empress is you libra um Fertility, some, and I did I mention something to do with a baby? <laughs> For some of you, there is something happening as well when it comes to that. But there's there's emotion that's happening that's bringing in uh, a joy with love, with with uh, things that sweeten your wee cup. E even if it's like small things, things are going to be sweetened. In, in, in a lot of ways. But you are having someone reveal their true feelings towards you as well. The two of wands here. The two of wands. You know, you are, you could be finding yourself in a situation also where you, you know, whatever decision you take right now could really alter things in a big way for the future. You may be a little hesitant, but here you see the world, it's very much yours. The world is your oyster. Don't be afraid. Be unafraid and take chances as well. Take, and that's your answer, the Queen of Cups. Take that chance. Take that leap of faith. Um, you know, the Queen of Cups is a strong card for love love in your life, love in your relationship, love for the things that you do. I do see love coming to, I did see that there's a lot of love coming towards you as well. But you are starting, look how many, look, we have the Queen of Pentacles, Queen of Swords, Queen of Cups, the Empress. You, Libra, are going to feel very powerful in different ways. You'll see. You're going to feel... Like I said, more in control, which you that makes you feel like you have that power, which you do. And that control, you're going to see how just you alone can really alter and state uh, and change things. You, know, you can alter the state of of many things, the way you feel, the way another person feels. I think you're just going to start to realize, wow, you actually. Um, I'm way more capable of doing so many things than you realize. And I said, said something mystical as well. I don't mean like Harry Potter magic wand. That's not what I mean. <laughs> um, you know, it's, it's just something within you. It's your high sense of something is opening up. Your awareness is, is definitely gaining a lot more power as well. Libra. Truly hope this helped. Really do. Please take care of yourselves and until next time, thank you all so much.